Wow, that's all I gotta do to be controversial? And here I was all ready to confess my illicit affair with a small green tree frog named Kemp. But I guess there won't be any need for that. Too bad. Hey guys, name's Fen playing a game on the net. Getting serpenty things. Back to a regular tech techy to tech tech. There's one of those doors. The other one was in an attic. The notes didn't say an attic. It said, oh, above a cathedral and above the yonder and wander over yonder. It's a good show. Watch it or die. You know, and it's funny because I absolutely love super positive stuff coming from other people, but I just can't bring myself to be that way myself. Maybe that's why I like it so much because it's such a difference from how I normally am, all cynical and... <sighs> and sarcastic. I don't even like sarcasm, but here I go, I do it all the time. It's weird. Well, okay, sometimes it's kind of funny, but yeah. Also, I've said I don't like shooters before, if you remember. If you don't, well, we're going to have to do something about that. That, that door has a stubby nose and that was <laughs> hysterically funny. You better stop your internal organs from moving about your spleen. There, because we are scientists. But da da dum bum 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 bum. Oh yeah, oh yeah, uh, yeah, oh yeah. There's there's rope needing stuff, but I don't have a rope arrow. That's crazy. What? I hate being ill prepared. You know what? It's funny because the whole unleash hell on earth thing. In my head, I was thinking I was gonna make it the evilest button ever, with a like a <laughs> kind of sound, but less dumb and. With like a big old evil bunch of text. I wonder if I would have gotten more controversy from that. Of course not. This is not a- This is not the St. John's Bible land. I think St. John is not a guy who ever translated a Bible, but like, you know. I display my ignorance at all times of the day. And also, I, uh... Whoa! His word, his truth, his voice, his blessed song. Karis is not as nasally as he sounds. You just gotta remember that shit. I have heard I do not know. Ah, seem to be in a pickle-shaped situation here. Oh. Who treads there? <laughs> Out of the pickle and into the yes, mushroom. Whoever what? knows. Brother Squeeze. Or Brother Squeeze. I've heard that thou hast almost completed the building of thy office. Excellent location and truth as the scream shall not disturb our brethren. Thy first assignment is to attend to the new brother who lost the armor key. His punishment shall be castration, which should at least prevent his adulterous behavior in the future. <laughs> <laughs> Keep up thy good work, brother, and I shall recommend thee for a position as technician in the meat mincer, Father Sahab. Oh, Nothing the meat mincer, of course, if you recall, is that place, <laughs> that horrible place with the copyrighted death metal music or black metal or something, uh, in yonder, um, you know, shadows in our blood. Amazing. Just a note, eh? Anyway, I've been doing this LP thing for like, whoa, for like, three years or whatever so like deal with it I guess because everybody's always walking around saying oh Finn you're so talented why don't you have so much as a burger flipping job or even more betterish work for freaking Microsoft except they're old and cranky so whatever the modern equivalent is except they were always old and cranky friend <sighs> so this is the library which I remember but I thought it was in another mission again I thought it was in freaking jeez what? Don't. I've played so many missions I can't remember anything, man. But I'm only here to have fun on this earth and not learn because blue solid glass like Pegasi jumping around on clouds is my favorite song. See, I can learn a thing. Jump, pump, jump, pump, and get down. Jump, jump. Oh, a library key. Well, that. That makes some amount of sense then, doesn't it, friends? <laughs> the completion of the library is upon us. It shineth in its newness, and its hotness, and its cleanliness is most pleasing to the eye. All that we requireth is necessary stationary items such as pen holders, waste baskets, and the reading lamps. We pray that we will receive them in the next shipment, and thus mayst begin to use the library as is right. Library is a difficult to say word in the accented language. <laughs> loot goal, loot goal, completing you is my entire life's purpose. It is what I call fun. I also call other things fun, such as abstinence, 
from everything, you know, make up your own mind, also making up my own mind, and also being stupid on the internet. Oh, yeah, yeah. I believe I may be going to a place which is a lot less exciting than the place that I just came from. Ah, it's here. And the library key shall open. I guess there's only one door to the library. Well, okay then. That definitely looks like a false truth. But oh well, I believe there is something in the middle here. I also believe there's a big old centerpiece puzzle around here somewhere, so let's find it and center ourselves. Because this is the land of the giving. Whoa, hey. Great. This looks like some sort of teleport maze. I think I know one when I see one, but I've thought things that were wrong before. If Maybe it's just a maze period. Yeah, that's probably what it is. Hey. This is a room with a weird thing in the wall that looks suspicious like T2X's weird thing in the wall in the first mission. If you'd like to check out Thief 2X, make sure to click this link and you can see it! Um, um. Well, at least it wasn't a teleport maze. However, there seems to be a door that doesn't open. I have to say that when I'm thinking, you know, it makes me think really, 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 really hard. Oh, the ladies love it, probably. Okay, so I'm going this way then. Fair enough, this actually isn't too bad of a maze. You can kind of remember where you've been, at least thus far, man. What pointless architecture taking up precious space on my SSD? How how dare you, sir? Now I've forgotten where I am, but fortunately, I'm gonna remember or I'm gonna die in these forsaken halls. What? Did I reach a dead end? How could this happen to me? Oh my god, what? Oh, I need the serpenty things for that door. Well, you know what? That's that I can't decipher and that I don't have, so I'm just gonna come back here later. Pretty sure there's another serpent thing in a tower. I don't remember where the third one is though, so that'll be fun to discover. Whoa! Jesus! I'm not gonna cease my flutterings. It's who I am, man. Don't you diss me, I'm gonna kill you. Kill! Well, that was certainly a shocking surprise, ice cream cone. Let's get a different flavor. Wow, it's got a watcher. It's got a newfangled bot. It's got at least one actual human. Holy shit, what? Oh, come on, newfangled bot. I don't want a hug from you. How am I even supposed to get up here? Wow. He's kind of over there, I guess. Uh, okay. Uh, okay, as long as he just circles, I should be good. Wow. This is kind of fun to ghost. Is that guy? Okay, he does sort of stop and turn around. Come on. Can at least get rid of one. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, uh. Everybody wants to hear me go, Oh, uh, uh, that's Father Sahab. Oh, well, he doesn't look like he sounds, but that's kind of my fault. You better like my commentary, because my playing is certainly not very skill-creating. <coughs> Alright, well, darkness at last, wherein I can brood. Possibly also breed. Oh! <coughs> like that robot is carrying a baby beneath it. That is one creepy, rific thing. I... I'm not quite sure what... What? Speak friend. Shut up. Speak friend and enter. Must be something else worthwhile up there. I mean, it's sure guarded well enough. Really, there must be. Ah, uh, ah, uh, that opens that one gate, if you recall. Oh, he turns that. Ugh, yet another grunt from Fen. Y'all better take a picture and just make it go viral. Why is an emotionally sensitive guy getting big on YouTube? He's gonna regret it. Maybe I can jump down from here, or not at all. It's just, uh, hey, we don't care about safety no more. Type of rail deal, possibly, yep. Yeah. I have to go back down the crazy insane old way. <laughs> Ugh. Right, I think I made it without having mentioned the war. Klaxity, clax, clax. Ho, 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 look at that old dark lighting. Whoo! Right, well. 
Off to find more stuff. One of these towers, I swear to you. Maybe I need a... I probably need a rope arrow. You know what? Always need a rope arrow. That's why they'll never go out of business. And if you take a job with Rope Arrows Incorporated, you'll n never, ever, ever die horribly from the starvations. Because as long as there's two people left on Earth, one of them is going to have a terrible Aussie accent. That wasn't an accent at all. That was like... Oh my god. But I disclaimed it as being terrible, so that makes it okay. That guy, though, he's also okay. Look at him shaking his head side to side saying, no, that means he's assertive. There sure are a lot of patrollers around this here property, what they own and value. Well, what has this clue by four got to tell me this time? Bill, Brother Pink Dot, the builders of this place not only were terrible sinners, but alas, their scene complexity runneth too high. Therefore, this footpath shall remain closed until further notice, Father Shrab. <laughs> yes, that's Pink Dot made this mission originally. And uh, I guess there was supposed to be a footpath there. Even in New Dark, though, we still can't climb over there. How disappointing. But, uh, Hapo sort of built on top of it, as I may or may not have said in the last video, because I edited a bunch because, Jesus, leave me be. Hawker, Hawker, Hawker. I think I may be onto a green door. What? This is a green door? What? No, oh, pfft. Green doors get the raspberry of death from me. Two thumbs sideways. But what hole here have we inside of our heads? Um. <laughs> you guys are not allowed to come up in my face. It's downright rude. Good. You get back in there and shame. Shame, I say. Shame. Sorry, I live on a farm. Okay, but seriously. This place must be extremely important to have people around up in it. Oh, what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, those guys seem to be angry, so I don't really want to go in there. However... Oh, there seems to be a ramp downwards in here, and I'm just going to run into somebody's face again. So instead, I'll just kind of cower in the doorway here. Cower, 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 etc. Good strawberries. Tastes like red. Guess they don't come down here? Well, that's weird, but this looks like loud ground. Oh, well, maybe not. <sighs> ba -ba -ba, whistling, whistling. Well, don't worry, it is. Everyone's afraid of rats, but mechs are not af are, 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 are afraid to admit that they will scream if they see a rat. Instead, they're just like, oh, wretched creatures, oh. Oh, man, everyone screams for rats. Oh, hey, three rope arrows at once. Well, I know where I'm going next, except I think that rope tower that I was talking about may not have been a rope tower, but hey. The presence of Brother Squeeze really worries me. He's always a merciless butcher from the days of the hammers. I heard from Brother Bellbulls about a hammer novice called Brother Small. He was four foot three inches when he entertained Brother Squeeze. Now he is seven foot six inches and thinks he's a cherry tree. What? Enter. They had to lock him away in Quintock Looney Bin because he used to paint his balls red and stand in the orchard. Although Brother Bellbulls said he looked more like a palm tree to him, we'd... I don't get it. We'd best watch our steps around here and make no mistakes, otherwise we will all be dancing for Brother Squeeze. You can almost smell him warming up his hot plates for the poor bugger who lost the armory. Okay, yes, well. That's why you be a thief, because you pretty much avoid the worst punishments. It's kind of hilarious. No! It's kind of regular. I should stop saying the same thing. It's kind of this, it's kind of that. Oh, hey. I need to report an incident to Father Killid. Brother Mustang was found dead earlier tonight. Although it doesn't really look like an accident as there's a big mace mark on his face. We scraped his brains back into his broken skull and put his body in a temporary coffin. How respectful. Is it here that they roam around? Yes, it is. Holy sh... Well, okay, these guys are like... Oh, shit. These guys are a serious bother. Oh, jeez. Indeed. As the builder himself... Wonder what the deal with that. I forget if you can get up I I saw. there. <laughs> Playing dishonored style, by which I mean <laughs> super lame, no light gem style. Oh, okay. I think I haven't been here yet. It looks like some sort of mechanized kitchen with a drill that I can't help but think of as another thing. Ever since memoirs of a dead good. Oh wait, I came from here, didn't I? Well, if that's the case. Okay, now I got my bearings. Excuse me, sir. You're not really gonna turn here, right? Now. I guess I'll let you go as I'm done with that place. <laughs> Look at that old dark lighting. And this is this room. Actually, where haven't I gone, in fact? 
Hmm. Is this not just the gate back to here? Oh, of course! I haven't gone to that gate with the cog with... Yeah. Yeah. Cogs. Yeah. Right, enough goofing around. This is a serious website tube site. Oh, man. Now I'm in this place where I could see here. And that did something. You know what? I wonder if that opened this hatch. Of course not. It would have made a sound. <laughs> no, but really, there's a... There's a switch on the side of the wall. What the hell does it do? It didn't even seem to turn off a light or anything. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay, I see. Well, it's a book. Maybe it's a code book. I understand the code now. Makes sense. Better read those coded notes again. Ah. Right. So it changes the notes so that they're not coded no more. Interesting. Cool. Okay, well, let's stand in the perfect broad daylight and read the noted code and the coded notes. I secreted the bronze serpent in a location known only to myself. Perchance I may not survive the mechanist attack and the location be forever lost. Thus, I will reveal to you how it may be found. It is hidden in the big attic behind the picture. Upon the floor in the big attic, you will find the red glowing light. Stand upon the light and the picture will rise. But speed is of the essence, for the picture will remain risen for only a moment of time. Borge holds the knowledge of where the other two serpents are hidden. I saw him run to the main chapel with them. Mar. Well, let's do that, and then I will totally forget to remember to read the other notes. Sound good? Cool. Except where the hell is the attic again? I've forgotten. Oh, could it possibly be sort of here, kind of? Oh, well, yes, yes it is. Where's that red light? Hang on, wasn't it? Wait, is this the right attic? Oh. Must have come from a different direction. Okay, well, anyways, stand on the red light. And it's probably the picture way over there. Um. Okay, speed is of the essence. Okay. Oh. Do I have a potion? No, not even. Do I need a potion? Do I need to stand on this longer so that it rises higher? Or do I need to stand on it shorter so that I can get there quicker? Hmm. Oh, damn you! Did I say stand on it lower? I meant stand on it shorter, obviously. Well, that should do it if anything does. Ugh. There we go. And with time to spare, that's two out of three... One of them is somewhere. Let's read the other note. Blah, blah, blah. Every button should be pushed once and only once. Don't start by pushing one. The letters should be pushed in the alphabetical order. Push B after two numbers have been pushed. Three should be pushed immediately after one. Half the letters are immediately followed by a number. Neither three nor four is the last number to be pushed. The final letter should be pushed immediately after all the numbers have been pushed. Oh. Well, it's... it's... Uh... It is a puzzle, but I don't know where to push the numbers. So... Where to next, murderous feline? Well, there's another disappearing door. I wonder why they only do it sometimes, though. Oh, hey, here's... Somewhere in... Wait. That didn't used to be blocked off, did it? Haven't I been here before? Weird? Have I been all around here? Man, there's a lot more than three of these places in there. Maybe not. Okay, well, here we are in the chapel. I don't know if I actually explored around here as much as I perhaps should have. Oh, this is probably the... No, this is that tower will... You know what? I remember something weird. I remember there being glyphs on a piece of wood. Okay, yeah. I don't know if that's wood up there. Maybe not. I gotta check. Oh, it is. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, this may be... <laughs> where I want to be. Maybe not. Maybe there isn't a serpent thing up here. Maybe it was just that one on the roof there, and I'm misremembering. That's probably it. That tower, though. Surely I haven't been up there. Uh-huh. These doors sure are funny. Yeah. Yeah. There they are. That's the puzzle. It's... Except not, because it's just glyphs. No, that can't be the number puzzle. Let's go... Three letters. Well, maybe there's some book that will tell me which corresponds to which. Maybe I've even found it and I've forgotten. That's always possible with me. You know how it is. Ooh. <gasps> oh, I should, 
didn't take the rope, actually. I need to get it. Oh, there is one on top. Oh, the Trinity. Well, that's nice. They just popped themselves malleable. That's cool. I Maybe the answer will be... Yeah, because that maze has got coded text as well. Uh -huh. And this is what happens when you get an episode where I do not have something on my chest. Strangely enough. It's not as funny. Oh, or I'm just tired and like kind of feared because it's late at night and what? Oh, for some reason in the dark, monsters come out blah blah blah. And also, it's coming up on a time when I need to do something in a professional capacity. What is just here? Oh. Okay. Or my life is just weirder. I think the labyrinth was somewhere around this a place. Yeah. Go up and there's this huge top-heavy thing that... Gotta see from the outside, because it make no freaking sense. This must be weird architecture or something, no? Maybe not. Let the hand be your guide. The hand. Let the hand be your guide. Oh, I probably need some item. Well, let's just put the stuff in. <laughs> there we are. The lucky hand of glory. Okay. Oh. Oh, I see. So they're pointing me... This way, I guess? <laughs> that is awesome. Man, that is so freaking cool. Um... Uh, yeah, I, it's probably like you can't do it without the hand, even if you memorize it or something. Yeah, I can see. Yeah. Ah, I thought there was a big chunkity chunk of lever or something, but... But no. Well, I kind of know where I need to go, but let's, uh... Oh, oh, I see. I need to find it out on my own. Fine. Okay, it was... This way, I... think? Ah, finally! Okay! So, I'm expecting I will get some sort of code book... Oh, what? Another one of these? Really? Do I...? No, they're just pointing me towards the glyph again. Ay ay ay. Ay 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 is a silly thing to say, but say it I will. Don't you think that I've had enough maze punishment for one day? What? What the hell is that? What the hell is that? Doesn't seem to do anything. Maybe I gotta shoot it or something. There's probably gonna be some ye old scroll like, And thus did thee spake about shooting the goblin right in his face. Hmm, there's two of them, at least. So I have to shoot two people dead. I don't know about this, man. Or I just have to place another one of them on here. I don't know, man. Or I've got to light these torches or something? No, that no, of course not. There's, so I guess there's four. Man. <laughs> and there's where I freaking came in. Is the item I need even up here? One. Two, three, and... Or to put it here. Oh my god, where am I even going? And that's just back. What the bloody. Not a huge fan of mazes, to be honest. Okay, well. Oh. Is that really supposed to happen? Probably not. They're probably supposed to light when you put something there, but I got nothing. Well, since I'm stuck, I guess I'm gonna just leave it here. And see you guys next time. And pay no attention to the man behind the curtain. He's only having some fun with his pet frog. Just don't even say anything. Bye!